Hi there, everyone. This is Morgana Hilra from So Hot SL. Uh, funny thing, I actually just did this review, but what happened was my mic was not active. That's fine. It's been taken care of. Everything is set. First, I'm going to touch base on the Beliza Venus version 3 update. It's uh, really cool, actually. Um, Basically what we have here is we got the new HUD, which is awesome, it minimizes, so that was a big thing. Um, a lot of us like to wear our HUDs out of the house and uh, go try on demos and stuff, so we kind of need that minimization there. Uh, we have your normal info HUD, which has your help, the blog, Facebook, Flickr, YouTube. There's no YouTube videos yet, but I'm sure that's coming. The link works though. Plurk where you got your hands and feet with all your options for your hands which honestly is one of my absolute favorite um, features of the mesh the Beliza mesh body always will be love it to death love it you got your feet I'm actually currently wearing um, sinful heels they're I actually chunky heels. I actually blogged them in the past, but I will post all that info in my blog post with the review. Uh, you got all your nail polish. You've got uh, save slots for fingernail pliers and toenail pliers. Your nail length, you know, medium long, pointed. You can also, for those of you who like to wear the um, mesh nails, you can disappear your nails altogether. I like to use medium or long. Um, you have the ability to wear your slink feet if that is your preference and your slink hands. Uh, you've got your uh, flat foot, medium, high and just designs. Then you get over here to your layers which as you can see I'm currently wearing my underwear layer. <coughs> I'm wearing it in mask mode apparently. I thought I was wearing it in blend but that's perfect. Mask mode means that, um, from what I can gather, is that it puts like a sh basically an invisible looking um, mask over your body so that way you can wear multiple layers. You got your alpha HUD, which we'll be going back to this in just a moment. You can save your alpha slot, so if there's outfits that you wear constantly, like say you have a saved outfit, you can actually pop the sucker open and click one of these and it'll show whichever um, alpha layers are hidden. You've got your neck options. For those of you that um, your body doesn't exactly mesh completely with your head, um, I was wearing it at zero, but ha, boy was I mistaken. See, I didn't realize that was back there. So I'm wearing seven, I could go 11, I guess. Hmm, I don't know. I like that, just like that. Oops, let's go back to seven. I just kind of like the way it makes my neck look. All right, um, you got your skins, your Beliza skins all up here. You also have a way to save your appliers. So if you've got another skin that you like to wear, like I tend to wear a lot of Glam Affair, you can put your saved um, tones in these little slots. Um, if you want to go completely insane, you can always just like pick different colors here. You've got your breast options. I'm currently wearing pushed up. <laughs> There's your perky and your natural. Let's go with perky. You've got your nipple options. Basically, they're mesh nipples. You can put them on. Uh, there we go. Mesh nipples. I'm actually... I don't know. I don't wear them, so I don't really play with them that much. Okay, so I'm going to actually tell you about the tattoo layers real quick here. Now, I searched all over YouTube for a Beliza um, tutorial on how to use the Omega system. And the only ones that I found were for other um, bodies and the one that I did find for Belize was like from a year ago and the woman was more long-winded than I was. I'm sorry, but it's the truth. 
uh, she made it sound so complicated, but it's actually not complicated at all. Ignore the instructions. Don't look at the website because believe me, you'll just get confused and lost. All you do is you unpack your Omega installer system, this thing right here. Make sure that you're wearing your mesh body. So as you can see, I'm wearing my mesh body. Okay, so you have your mesh body on, you wear your Omega system, then you up, you click your applier, your, actually, you don't click your applier, you wear your applier. Um, let's go here, we're going to use Tengen, and it might get a little confusing, but <laughs> whatever, we'll figure it out. So you've got your this thing on, then you click up here. You wait for this. Thank you for activating your Omega system. Now, I've already activated it, but I'm sure that's not going to cause any problems. A lot of the times I tend to click it anyway. And then you pop this sucker open, see here. I'm going to go with a clothing layer, see if that'll work better. So we do that, and we wait and hope for the best. Ah, there we go. See, it works. Yay! It's in mask. So I'm not sure if it would work with blend. Um, I suppose we could try it. It's probably going to disappear, but... Oh, it works! Awesome! Oh my god, you have no idea how exciting that is for me. I was having such a grand old time trying to get that to work. Uh, you can also use your lower as well, down here. Mm -hmm. See how it's, it's back to saying mask? I'm not sure why that does that, but whatever. Who cares? It's working. That's the important part. So then you can just take that off. I am actually going to clear this off. Actually, I'm going to take that off. All right. And that's another thing about the new HUD. They have the clear all, which is awesome. I love that they have the clear all because it just drives me insane when I'm putting on something and I can't get rid of another item. Um, I'm currently wearing a Holly Pocket bikini. Um, the link for where you can pick this bikini up, if it's a mega head, will be in my blog post. Keep that in mind. You've got your texture refreshes. Um, not 100% sure what that means, but I'm assuming it's just so that you can, you know, if there's a glitch, you can just clear that up. All right, so I've done the skins, the layers, your mega head, so. I'm hoping that I simplified the Omega Head System installer. Um, okay, so I thought I had a whole bunch of stuff like preset and ready to go to try on um, with the. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> I forgot that I had this. I was going to vlog it today. Well, guess what? Oh, look at that! It actually almost fits perfectly. <laughs> All right, so we're going to actually see a bit of my. Um, where I live, so do, do, do. I live here with uh, family and friends, so here we go. Alpha layer. Let's just bop that pelvis out of here. Come on. Alright, so see how it uh, has that there. We can actually go through and re-click this stuff. Ah, oh, look. Fits perfectly, huh? Pretty much. I mean, there's still, you can still see a little bit right in there, but whatever. <laughs> this is one of the outfits that actually fits nicely, or skirts. And it's from CC's, and it's from the mix event. That actually looks really pretty. I like that. <laughs> uh, so we see that fits just perfectly. So we'll take that off. Pew! Reset this. That's another thing I absolutely adore is the reset button. Uh, we're going to go find a pair of pants that I absolutely adore. They're from Sinful. We're going to go with skinny jeans. Um, now I wear the medium because I wear my own personal shape. Um, you might want to wear like uh, the shape that's included. I believe there's a shape that's included with it. But I like my individuality. I like to be different. So what I like to wear might be different than what other people like to wear. Okay, so there goes the pelvis. I'm going to have to go through and pop that sucker back on. 
it's not a big deal. Um, right there is one that I kind of wanted to see if we could ever get like a little bit of an extra to. Whee, there we go. I like my low cut jeans, so I'm glad I can wear those. Ta da! See? Works almost perfect, right? Here on. Actually, works perfect. <laughs> Switch up some. As you can see, I'm, wear I'm using my bang poses. Uh, ah, here we are. That's what I was talking about right there. You can't see it from the back, but you can see it here. Can you see my hand right there? I wonder if they have that area. Oopsie. <laughs> Pop it. Yeah, okay, I guess that covers that. Oh, there's like a little bit right there. So, almost perfect. I like that. Um... As you can see, as you move around, there's spots that pop through, and you can't really get rid of that, because if you do that, then you have that gap right there. Oh, there we go. You can sort of see it there. Ding, ding, ding. Um, but I can live with the little pieces sticking out here and there. One thing that I do have a problem with are some tank tops. Um... Some of my tops don't like to fit. Let's go hunting for some tops, shall we? Here, top. Ooh, hoochie. Um, I absolutely love these guys. I don't know if I can actually... Oop, that's a skirt. That's not going to work. <laughs> okay, black top. Do, 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 do. Um... Yeah, I won't be able to wear that with this. <laughs> Let's get rid of that. Um, hubbada, 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 hubbada. Let's come all the way down here. Indra. Maybe that'll work. Maybe not. Yeah, I wasn't as well set up for this as I had thought I was. Um, maybe this will work. Ah, that might work. Okay, so we're in this and, you know, you obviously want to get rid of all these little pieces here. Do -do -do -do. Okay. Now, it, it appears to look pretty good, right? Uh, the problem is, is that some shirts, this area here is a little bit higher, and you can't um, use that tab right there because of this. What I'd like to see is for this area, um, for this one um, alpha layer, maybe to be cut in half. So then that way you can either wear it like that or like, you know, half the area. Like maybe this area here would be... Um, I guess blocked off or whatever. Alfred. <laughs> so that top is from Tulip. Tulip. Alright, so... It's very pretty. I like that outfit. <laughs> not bad for not actually planning on wearing that, huh? Alright, so, I mean, there are like little things here and there. I, I'd like to see the butt maybe um, half, like, across there. Maybe an extra layer here, but um, like right in the pelvis area there. Um, like I said, that this is like one of my absolute favorite bodies, like, ever. <laughs> I love the hand gestures. I love the fact that I can actually wear my slink shoes. Um, it wasn't done on purpose, but it's just a happy coincidence, and I like that. Uh, there are shoes out there that are made specifically for this body. Uh, Belize has actually come out with two new bodies. One is a fuller figure, and one's a thinner figure. I believe Isis is the thinner one, and uh, Freya is the more full-figured one. I will do... Um, posts on those in the future, but I wanted to cover the recent updates. Um, I will have everything from this video in the description below, so 
please make sure that if you're reading, if you're reading, if you're watching this on YouTube, that you check the link below, and that will take you to the blog post. If you are on my blog watching this, thank you very much for being a reader of mine. You have no idea how much you mean to me. This is my fifth year, and <laughs> you guys keep me going. So thank you for that. Uh, for customer service, if you're having trouble with your mesh body, then please contact um, the creators, but not the creators. Talk to their um, their staff, which would be where is she? Felicity Blumenfeld. Blumenfeld. I will put her name in the description, in the information below the video. Um, I guess that's pretty much everything. Please understand that although I sympathize if you're having trouble with your mesh body, I am not a technical person. I wouldn't be able to help you. So this is why it's important to make a note card and send it to the customer service and they will send it to the appropriate people. Um, Tricky and Shyla are very busy, so if you send Felicity your note card, they can get your questions answered faster. There's nothing I can personally do. Um, I had my own issues, and like I said, with the um, Omega HUD system, and I figured it out on my own. Um, but it's, it's a pretty simple system. It's a great body. Um, lots of options. You can save everything, which is awesome. <laughs> I'm going to get this up and running for you, and I will have the link for the blog ASAP. I hope this answers any questions or um, curiosities that you may have had. I will do my best to stay up on my reviews. I know that there has been a lot of questions on if I was going to review the Eve body. Um, there's actually a few bodies out there that I would like to review. Uh, and as soon as I can get my hands on them, I promise I will put I will post the reviews as soon as I can. Um, hmm, what else? I guess that's about it. Thank you for being my YouTube watcher or my blog reader. You guys are awesome. And I will try to get more videos and stuff out throughout the year. So, thanks. This is Morgana Hilra again, Sohad SL, and I'll be seeing you soon. Bye.